Hi everyone, in this problem we have to find the derivative of the natural log of the square root of x. So if we just take the derivative, uh, because it's not ln x, we'll have to use a chain rule and we'll have to differentiate a square root function. So it might be better to try to rewrite this in a nicer way. So we have f of x, so we're going to rewrite it. And this is equal to ln. And whenever there's a square root, you can write it as x to the 1 half. So um, I just have it memorized. However, what if the numbers were different? So if, when there's a 1 here and there's a 2 here, it's x to the, and it's always going to be this number over this number. So 1 over 2. And now what we'll do is we'll take the 1 half and we'll bring it down and put it in the front. That's called the power rule for logarithms. So f of x is equal to 1 half times the natural log of x. Notice um, it's f of x each time. That's because we haven't taken the derivative yet. So really key. So we're rewriting first. Now we're going to take the derivative. So f prime of x. I don't know why it got bigger. <laughs> So the 1 half hangs out because it's in front of a function of x. And then we just multiply by the derivative of the natural log of x. Well, what is that? That's just 1 over x. And that's pretty much it. You can leave it like this. If you like, you can actually perform the multiplication here. Um, let's go ahead and do that. So 1 times 1 is 1. And then 2 times x is, is 2x. And that would be the derivative. I hope this video has been helpful.